Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm here with my sis. And today we're gonna be vlogging my very first tattoo. Woohoo! I'm basically just nervous because I don't know what my mom's gonna say about it. My brother has a big ass tattoo on his forearm, so she didn't tell him nothing, so I expect the same reaction. I'm still not sure if I'm gonna be getting it in black ink or red ink. I really wanted red ink, but I don't know. I'm kind of like, eh. We have an appointment at 2, and it's 11.30. Okay, let's go. And we're gonna stop by um, on our way there and get something to eat. The place is in Orlando, so it's about, what, an hour mm -hmm. or so? An hour or so from, from where I live, so. Yeah, that's what we're gonna be doing today. To my hair now. You only live once. It's gonna be Delisa's age, and she's gonna wish you. I'm gonna put this shit in here. I told her that. What? To her face. What? I said it's pretty. Y luego tenemos su edad de 50 años y nos queremos pintar el cabello. No, I am not. I don't want to dye it for sure. Oh no. Okay. I, if there's one thing I would tell you not to do is don't dye it. I don't know. I just need to stop being a lazy bitch. Yeah. Oh, it's hot. You should trim it and then just make an effort to straighten it. Trim? Mm -hmm. But I feel like... I don't know. I was gonna say, I feel like I should do either stay with long hair. Like oh, I see what you mean. Two extremes. But also my hair, my best length is like that awkward medium length. It is. That is your best length. Because too long... Mm, I don't like your hair too long. I don't like my hair too long either. It's cute. We look advanced hands. But I also don't think you would look good with like this haircut. Oh no, I definitely wouldn't. We'll record when we're at the tattoo shop. Because we're nervous. I'm nervous for my mom. I'm just kidding. So she tried both positioning and she ended up liking this one. She's not going to actually get it in red ink. What What? What if I like turn it a little bit? ¿Se miraría chueco? No, I So think, that it can align with my... I think you should leave it like that. Hey mom. <laughs> <laughs> Well, if you don't, <laughs> it don't really matter. <laughs> no, it looks really good. Are you ready for your tattoo? Don't zoom in my face. Are you ready? Yes. Mm -hmm. Are you ready, JB? <laughs> I'm ready. He's gonna have to shave my arm because I'm hairy as hell. The Mexican traits. <laughs> from straight from Aztec. 
my ass tight roots. <laughs> we could possibly be Mayan, you know that, right? Or my Mayan roots, whatever. <laughs> I don't think we could be Inca. Okay. So right here? Right here? Yep. Right? Because mm -hmm. then it'll all move together. Yep. What do you want to say to your mom? Mom, I just want to apologize in advance <laughs> for being a disappointment. <laughs> No, I deserve to do what I want. Did you want? Oh, he's gonna put the stencil. He put all the stencils on me. Shout out to my mom for being supportive on my tattoo. Oh, I love how they put caution. The mirrors in the look up there. It says objects in the mirror are backwards, and then it shows you how they're backwards. <laughs> I never thought about that caution sign, but it's like when you're getting a tattoo and then you look at it and you're like, <gasps> and it's like backwards. Oh, absolutely. Flat twist, I pass out. Has tenido clientes que se desmayan? Venimos en Orlando. Porque vamos a ir al arroz, mam. Oh, okay. Órale, mam, va. All right, sis. So, how was your first tattoo experience? It was exactly like what I thought it was gonna feel like. Do you have you ever um? Do you remember like back in the day, the thing in like 2006, 2007, there was these little things where you would pull with the gum mm -hmm. and then like you would push something and it was like a laser. Mm -hmm. It literally felt like really, really small shock and then like a little bit sharper, like a like a needle. You could feel the needle, but mm -hmm. it feels more like a little shock, like it's mm -hmm. like kind of shocking you. Like. But every time people say, oh, it hurts so bad, no. like I don't believe it. It's definitely nothing like what people tell, have told me, like, oh my God, it's gonna hurt so bad. But I'm like, um, it, at the light, turn it wasn't light like a comfortable lot, thing, but it wasn't like, oh my God, I can't. I've gotten my eyebrows threaded and that hurts probably 10 yeah, times more. That than, hurts more. That hurts like 10 times more. Than yeah, right. so if you're interested in like knowing the pain level and if you've gotten your eyebrows threaded, it hurts way it less hurts than that. It hurts way less than eyebrow threading. I was scared it was going to hurt like my eyebrow and like my my hands start to tingle when I thread my mm -hmm. eyebrows because it kind of hurts so bad. My brother, my sister, and I all wanted to get a matching tattoo. Um, at first, we wanted to get a triangle. And it's kind of signifying us as like a trio. A triangle adds up to 180 degrees. 180 degrees divided by three is 60 degrees. Like me, 60, my brother, 60, my sister, 60, we add up to 180, which makes the triangle, the total degrees of the triangle, which makes us the strongest trio. We're gonna see what my mom says about our tattoos. Stay tuned. ¿Qué piensas de mi tatuaje? No quiero que grabes. Ya que viste mi tatuaje y el de mi sis, ¿qué piensas? La vida se va a acabar. A mí nunca me ha gustado que tengan tatuajes, pero igual, o sea, es su decisión de ustedes, o sea, ¿qué, ¿qué voy a hacer? No soy de la idea que la gente tenga tatuajes, pero ¿Por qué? porque no me gusta. Y ya, y no quiere decir que la gente que traiga tatuajes es mal, conozco gente que tiene tatuajes y no es mala. 
pero a mí no me gustaba que mi familia tuviera. So, ¿qué es tu verdict, mom? So, my mom still loves us. My brother's still the favorite somehow. We're leaving my house right now because we're going to my brother's. My mom kicked us out. No, she didn't. You saw my mom's reaction. I was surprised. She wasn't like mad. I know it seemed like she was mad, but she's been like madder. I think she was kind of just like, well, you kind of already did it, so why be mad? Mm -hmm. Okay, well, we're actually on our way to drop off sushi for my bae and then go to my brother's house. So I'll see y'all when we get there. Is it too big to be in that? Can we really come over? Special to delivery. Right Look at my tattoo. Bruh. Do you see? It's real. Ow! Can you touch it? No, well, yeah, but don't poke it. You can touch it. It has the little thing on top. 60 degrees. Oh, you got a two? Why and then she you got, got, got a black. You should have got a real light. <coughs> I don't like red. She didn't like it. When are you going to get yours? No, you're not We should it. all three of us should get sushi. But today the next day and looks good. I'm supposed to keep this patch on for about three days, I believe he said. If you do want to have more information on the tattoo artist who did this, he has amazing, amazing work. He's so good. His name is JB. Um, I'll have his Instagram down below or somewhere on the screen. So if you're looking for a tattoo artist, especially for words and stuff, um, his Instagram, he posts all his work. So yeah, um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I, like I said, all of JB's stuff will be down below if you want to check out his work. He's in the Orlando area. Thank you so much for watching this video. And I'll see you on my next vlog.